So verse 32, today's project, how to make the shield of faith. Paul talked about it in the book of Ephesians chapter 6. So we're going to learn how to make um, the shield of faith. Something you can hang in your office or your, your home. I'm um, stand by how to make the shield of faith. Out of cardboard and construction paper. So just stand by the first three two. The shield of faith. Uh, about 20, maybe about 26 inches long. 27. Maybe about 27 for this one. You can make your top of your shield in a curve. You can put a kind of a circle. Look at the top. And then make the bottom kind of curve. Both ends with a curve. Like that. You can have the straight too, but up to you. Then cut the bottom. Get our bottom shape. Like that. And top. Cut out. The half circle here at the top. Starting to shape up somewhat. Now, from here, we want to determine um, how wide we want our lettering to be, and also how large we want our lettering to be. We're going to put the word faith across the shield. So, I have some lettering cut out, but this is going to be too um, large for this particular shield. You can make the letters as small as possible. Small as fit. I had some cut off from a previous shield I made, give you an idea. And kind of get it to fit like that. You want some space here. Or you can have it coming all the way all the way to the end. I did one design like that. You can have it coming all the way to the end. That's an idea of how large you may want your lettering. You may want to center it. Like that. So the next main thing is getting something to cover your shield. Um, construction paper, aluminum foil, eighth shield. Get your cardboard the size that you you know how big you want it. You can cut the piece out of here. Usually, I've used a uh, blue for I'm going to take and uh, kind of break it off. Just take it. Take and wrap it around your shield. It doesn't take long to make this. I'm going to just tape and put tape on there. I'm going to take your 
tape. This is just normal packing tape. Just fix the cardboard real good. Get everything in place. Kind of press on it to get it smoothed out. And your construction paper, whatever you want to use. Make sure everything is flat and sealed down real good. I need to do it again. I already have some cut out to make this three dimensional. Now you can do the flat. I have these letters. Actually, I have maybe three um, stacked on top of each other. Come up to the face and make it stand out somewhat. That's another idea. You're going to have to take these letters and um, cut them. Actually cut the letters out that you can um, see through there and put a light behind it and you can make their sign. That's the project down the road. You're going to use um, lighting and to make it stand out if you have it in your room at night. You can use it for a night light. This is just the basic, basic idea of how to um, Give you a shield of faith. So basically get your cardboard, get your main uh, section here together, your shield, cover it up with whatever material you're going to use. Get your laddering. And you're pretty much um, Done with that, and you can um, um, add to it as you go. So basic chill. Show sure, some that I've done already. This is one with a cross on it. Um, got it kind of three-dimensional here. This instruction paper. This one. The smaller one, the same design. And it actually has some handle on the back. But um, it's just some wine. You can just slide through the board and uh, kind of twist it together to make a handle. If you want to hang it. Take this, use it for a template, and make probably uh, three more to make it thick. And three more layers, wrap it in tape, wrap it in clear tape. And stack them, wrap them, put your uh, decoration on top, uh, construction paper, whatever you want to use, or spray paint it, 
gray and um, if you have your sword you can put the um, the word or the word of God on, on there and letter it letters and uh, use your imagination you, you have your sword verse 2 in Kabachi and don't forget to subscribe